I came back to where I had the most success and juice box, you guys definitely did it. And I I heard this from a movie once it says, is the, is the juice worth the squeeze? Definitely. I received my first lead with you guys, I think on Thursday, I met with them on Saturday and we're closing them on this Saturday. Just by using that one sheet or my first lead, we simplified it. I used the forecaster. I used everything that Juicebox was providing me, their presentations. After that, he just, he knew the differences between what he's doing compared to what we can do. And that summary, this is the, all their benefits in one sheet. I was at Juicebox about three years ago. I'm a, I came back just recently. I have leads that were about three years old. So me and my team started calling them and we ended up finding a like a $2 million guy that has money just in stocks. And when we met today, I showed him the forecaster and he started telling me like, oh, I also have this. I also have Robinhood. I also have that. And the, I wouldn't have been able to do that without the forecaster. After that, it was a smooth transition. We told them, well, our company does this and this. And, you know, after seeing the forecaster and what we provide, he's like, yeah, let me see what I can do. Like now he wants to roll over. I don't know what amount yet, but he wants to do about 250 minimum. That was one of my biggest mistakes when I first did juice box. I was like, I don't need this training. I got this and I did it. I was like, I think you guys were barely developing the forecaster when I had had to leave. I was like, oh, I can't do this no more. I, I went back to the work field. I said, you know what? Um, I'm gonna use my degree, I'm gonna try this teaching thing. And then recently I got booked long-term teaching job and I was like, oh my goodness, is this my future? Like I look at all the teachers around me and I'm just like, I don't wanna look like them. I don't want this to be my future. And it scared me so much. I told my wife, I said, I'm, I'm out. <laughs> I'm motivated enough of what I don't want. So I ended up calling one of them, Steven, who I was talking with. And I said, I told you, just like Terminator said it, I'll be back. Yeah, and he was like, let's meet up. And that guy is so awesome. He stayed in touch with me. We met and I, I was just so eager about it. I said, you know what, it, it motivated me. I don't want that to be my future. I know where I'm great at. I know people need our help. Mm -hmm. And my wife's like, if you're gonna do this, you have my support, but you gotta do it the way Juicebox is meant to do it. And she watches the training with me. Now she's also licensed, but she's a banker and mm -hmm. she has all the licenses. And she's like, this better be my retirement plan. She goes, you better make it happen. So I was like, okay. <laughs> she's like my coach. She's like, did you make your calls? Did you do this? Did you do that? And I'm just like, man, I barely sat down for five minutes to take a rest. And she's like, well, this is what you wanted. You can't complain about it now. Definitely, you know, it definitely helped out so much. And it reignited me that you can't even think of. People in my leadership in my own company just forgot about me. They didn't call me back, didn't help me. Now that they're seeing my numbers on the board, because I already submitted two plans. And now they're like reaching out and I'm like, I'm okay because you guys didn't help me. Like you guys weren't there when I needed it, when I was struggling, when I had to go deliver food to make a living for when I had to go do Uber, like none of you guys were there, but I came back to where I had the most success and juice box, you guys definitely did it. And I I heard this from a movie once, it says, is the, is the juice worth the squeeze? Definitely. Wow.